How's it going guys? Matt here from the Toasty Bros and I am here with an overview of my networking setup. Now we're going to go handheld on this because this is a very, very out of proportion network setup and it's kind of in an area where it's really hard to get to so we're just going to go handheld here and go old school style and basically go over what my basic but very nice networking setup consists of. Let's roll that intro. Alright guys, to start things off, we have my Netgear ProSafe 5-port Gigabit Ethernet switch. So, this switch is a 5-port switch which is running from the main modem downstairs in my basement up to here and then runs off into my WD, my cloud, and router. So let's just go over what I have in this setup. So this is a gigabit switch that I picked up a long time ago. Really haven't used for some reason. I don't know why, but I decided to grab it and just put it on my networking setup. Um, originally, my networking setup actually just consisted of a my cloud and a router, and it was it was very bad because I literally had this coming off the router the modem and going into my router and just running stuff off of the router which was a very bad setup and it was really poorly set up by on my part because networking has never been my forefront so i really just kind of organized it a little bit better so after i got my switch up and running i decided to set things up a little bit differently so that's how this setup is about and we're going to go over it real quick so Right here you have the ethernet coming off towards the, I'm assuming one of these is for the MyCloud, which I'm just going to assume it's this one. No, it's this one. This one is for the MyCloud. Comes off and goes into the back right here, which the WD MyCloud is a NAS solution. Now, if you don't know what the NAS is, it's a network attach, attach storage solution, which basically I use for backups. I put all my video files and all that sort on here, and it's a really good way to back up files when I have a lot of issues, especially with my computer, because it's a very volatile system. So having a MyCloud, which this is a two terabyte model with an expansion on the back for any other external drive, really awesome thing, really awesome user interface. If you all want me to do a review of the MyCloud, I can definitely do that. So leave a comment below if you want to see a review of the MyCloud and basically get a YouTuber's perspective of having a NAS. So right next to that is my Netgear router. Now this is a N100 router, I'm assuming. Um, look on the bottom, it's an N150 router. Uh, I can't really get a focus because I don't have a free hand, but there it is, an N100 router. It's wireless in, it's not AC, which is something I really want to upgrade to. Really just haven't had the funds for, but with my internet connection only being 18 down and one up, this router does the job for me. It just is really used as a wireless extender more than anything because my modem is all the way down in my basement, which is way too far away and I always get drop signals. So having my own router up here is as my wireless access point is really awesome and it's just, it's just a good setup to have here and I have this running off to my main PC which is over here as you can see I'm kind of uploading content right now um teasers 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 but basically yes it's running over there and powering my TV as well so you know this is my basic little networking setup there's a bunch of pros and cons to it the pros it's very simple it does what I need the cons is it's just simple there's some things that I could definitely do differently and probably upgrade but really just I have no need to it's a really nice setup I have a Netgear switch that has a couple extra ports on it so I could do some other things if I want to I also have a 10 port switch that I could use but I it's kind of not necessary because this is all I have right now so um, but yeah, this is a really nice networking setup for me, just does the job. The main thing that I like to feature is my MyCloud, which is a really cool piece of technology, and I highly recommend it for people who really have a lot of sensitive data that they want to back up. So yeah, this is a quick rundown of my networking setup. We haven't been uploading recently due to a bunch of end of the year sorts of stuff, so I really just wanted to do a vlog style type video to get this out to you all. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns about my networking setup, please leave them in the comment description below. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Peace out.